I was on the pill for 10 years. I started it when I was 15. I went through puberty on the pill and I did not take a break. What I know now, if I knew that back when I was 15, I never would have gone on the pill. When I was 15, I grew, I grew up in a very sex positive household. Um, I went to my parents, I had a new boyfriend. I want to go on the pill. I thought that was the only option other than condoms. My doctor screened me for things like, is there breast cancer in the family, deep vein thrombosis, all those very like generic questions didn't really suggest any other options and said, yep, okay, here you go. I didn't know that there was other contraceptive methods that were equally as effective and had uh, less detrimental side effects that really affect your brain, especially as a teenager that is developing. I'm very passionate about this area of research because Doctors don't tell you the psychological side effects of going on hormonal contraceptives. Yes, okay, there is side effects like nausea, headaches, acne, um, but there's also much deeper um, research that has been done on how the pill affects your brain, particularly your mental health, but also your mate preference, um, who you choose on the pill uh, is potentially very different to who you would choose off the pill. It also affects the ability for you to grow muscle. My aim here is to give you the tools so that you are able to make an informed decision about what contraceptive method you want to go on. I wish that when I was 15, I had someone that told me everything there was to know about the pill and other contraceptive methods so that I could make an informed decision 